Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, my name is Marco and today we are continuing Dr. Stone. I will be watching episode number 15 and I can't wait to see what happens now that we finally defeated Magma. From, or should I say, everyone together uh, are responsible for this victory and it was just so satisfying, I like all the little twists, right? I really couldn't predict how would these battles go on and Kinro obviously won. Kinro is definitely better warrior, right, than Magma, uh, especially after he got his glasses, right, after he got Suika's mask and he was wondering if that's according to rules, if that's like the outside factor that helped him fight, I mean, he was handicapped to begin with. if his sight was bad, right? That was like, not fair as well, so yeah, but Kinro is all about the rules and he's super nice and of course that this comeback Magma will take advantage of that and he whacked him on the head from behind and the grand bout continued. Uh, Chrome against that little guy, we obviously saw that he lost on purpose, so that Kohaku won't be able to make it in time and that happened, she was disqualified, that was quick thinking from Magma, unfortunately, but uh, it was so wholesome to see Kohaku not caring about anything else other than Suika's safety, I really liked that scene, Ginro and that guy, <laughs> that was something I didn't expect, man, that was really, really interesting fight, to say the least, man, Ginro is hilarious, I, I like that, it was funny how he got diarrhea later on, was wilding out and <laughs> getting naked to take a shit man he couldn't even get to the toilet and of course senku with his calculations and my boy Krom with his plan to use suika's lens right and position of the sun to burn magma how ironic right to burn magma <laughs> I really, really loved that scene, especially after he won and everyone kinda gathered around him and he's all bloody, right? He took some beating, but he was victorious in the end, thank, thanks to everyone's efforts. So I really, really enjoyed that episode a lot. I can't wait to see what happens next, guys. Without further ado, let's start episode number 15. Let's go. Alright guys, everything is ready, let's start. I'm so happy that I'm watching this show, because I know that I will have fun no matter what. It's just a wholesome and fun show. So you captured the village. I forgot to mention Asagiri again, man, and his jutsu <laughs> of making Magma's heart explode, man. He's a really good mentalist. The Chrome would be the winner. Yeah, and that would be the best option, man. <laughs> the priestess I have no such thoughts, man. <laughs> it's not like that, but... Oh my god, don't tell me... Exactly, but Ginra is a fucking dumbass! <laughs> He's gonna be like, oh, now I will try hard to win. Oh god. Here we go. Scumbag! <laughs> and it explodes, that little tiny part of his brain. <laughs> Look at Sanko's face! Oh, fucking Ginro. <laughs> Look at his face. Such an idiot, bro. Bro, poor Senku. Yeah. Anyone but you. <laughs> Literally all the villagers. Senku is doing pretty good job evading. Our weapon is science, is it not? It is indeed. Again with the Suika's mask. How will Senku make use of it though? I doubt he would burn Ginro. <laughs> wow, 
what the fuck? That's what you get, Genro. I'm sorry. And Senku won. <laughs> okay, this guy is interested in Senku. But he passed out. Does that mean that Senku won the grand bout? <laughs> what the hell is this list? I mean, it's a cliche for main character to win a tournament like this, but it wasn't obvious in Dr. Stone, right? Because Senku is obviously a scientist, not a fighter, man. And how all these battles developed. I did not expect Senku to actually be the one who won. I mean, it doesn't even matter who win at the end of the day, right? Oh my god. They're all processing right now. They're all processing what is happening right now. Will you shave the husband of the priestess? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Bro, position of village chief and marriage partner acquired. <laughs> nice one, man. The culmination of two million years. What now? It's gonna be fine. I'll do it then. <laughs> Look at Mori, she's blushing. I mean, the rules are rules, right, Kinra? <laughs> He's poking his ear. <laughs> According to rules, right? <laughs> but what is he going to use that vine for? <laughs> oh, she's actually bleeding this time. Was I right that she actually have tuberculosis, man? Damn, he doesn't have time for now, right now, for that shit. I'm divorcing! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That was the shortest relationship ever, bro. <laughs> After insane, yeah, they can process what the fuck is going on. First divorced priestesses ever. <laughs> oh, she sounds so sad, man. But... Oh, right, Kron. I like that name. I ship Kron and Rui. I mean... <laughs> yep. The perspective is slowly changing, slowly but surely. Of course you did, man. You're the gold. <laughs> ah, he calls his creations. Children. <laughs> Give me a break, Grandpa. Oh, <laughs> he will never change his mind. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> we called man. Say that again. Chrome, he looks like a <laughs> toddler here. <laughs> oh, alcohol, perhaps. Oh, ammonia, yeah. Science team! Time to work, baby. We are getting really close. And Ruri's condition is worsening. I'm with making sulfur drugs. Step one, okay. My boy Chrome has loads of everything. Where's the coal? ちんぱいするな。てめえが集めたような雑魚石炭なら、その辺の山でも<笑> 
Yes, <laughs> so I can saw that one. Yeah, we're getting the montage, man. We're we're getting close to creating antibiotic, man. Let's go. <laughs> Is he holding the piece? It's genius, right? Thanks to water, we we are generating power. Oh, carbonated water! What the hell? <laughs> For cola. It is. <laughs> Holy shit! Yep. Science is not an easy thing, man. え、そうなんだ。あ、<笑><笑> そこにアンモニア shut out to Subaru's voice. I keep saying Subaru. Senku's voice actor, man. Baking soda. But actually, it's Cola on his mind. Step 25, so he was actually right. It's crazy that they had exactly that much. Yep. All the steps from the map, man. It's such a nice feeling. The cure all so far drug. Let's go! Let's get to Ruris, man, immediately. <laughs> Just wait a little bit longer. Hold on. Why? <laughs> Too bad. Yeah, he helped us and isn't Senku still like the leader of the village? Even though he's divorced. Or that's like the... Condition. He left him the bottle of cola. What a guy, Senko man! Nice. And that's probably how you make cola. Ooh. And it seems like it's cold because he was talking about that. <laughs> Oh, we don't have a capsule. Or she can just take... Take it in that form. Alright. This is exhilarating. <laughs> that's... that's... <laughs> a bit odd, but... Let's go. There we go. He's trying to listen to her lungs, man. Nice. <laughs> like a true doctor. Ruined in her lungs. He's probably going to experiment on the mouse, right? It's crazy that mouses have like more than 95% human DNA. Bro. That's crazy, kinda, isn't it? Oh, he's about to cut it. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, shit. Uh. Bro, thank God that I didn't have those classes in school, man. I don't know. Uh, I just saw it in like American movies or whatever where you like dissect frogs and stuff. Did you guys have that in school, man? We didn't have that shit. We did collect bugs and stuff for biolo biology, but we didn't <laughs> have, have to do this shit, man. Yeah. That is very true. 
He thinks the same. We don't stand a chance yet. The Brocolosis is something else, man. Oh, look at her eyes. This really looks bad right now. And she just took the drugs. Oh no. They will think that Senku did something. Senku dropped to his knee. Wait, wait. <laughs> oh my god. The bacteria is getting serious. Making allies. <laughs> special move. <laughs> But it's not tuberculosis, though. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, nice. <laughs> we won, baby. Human science has won. <laughs> Throw more sofa drag at her. Let's go, Kokaku! Oh, this is such a nice scene. She's so sweet. Oh, <laughs> my boy grow. Everyone. Hell yeah. Mm. So wholesome. <laughs> so it was thanks to Kohaku's effort, man. Every freaking day carrying that bro actually extended her life. Just enough to, for this point. Oh, this is actually phenomenal. So it's both Senku and Kohaku who saved her life and everyone else, man. Oof. Let's. <laughs> Everyone will look Senku completely different right now. <laughs> the way she runs. Wow. Is she coming? Is that... Oh my god, and she was about to say, is she right? Oh my god, oh we are about to end the episode and we won't do that now. Is Ishigami Senku? And my boy Senku is of course bamboozled how she knows that man. Wow. We finally did it man, we finally got antibiotic and we cured Rory. What a wholesome episode, what a wholesome and fun show this is. All right, guys, after 15 episodes, man, I feel like we've reached a point where one part of the story has ended, right? And so far, everything that happened was phenomenal. And we managed to cure Rory. We created antibiotic, the sulfa drug, and it worked, thankfully, because she had pneumonia, right? That's also kind of dangerous disease, but not so much, right? Especially in this current age. I mean, any disease can be deadly, man. It depends on people and their, like, uh, uh, immune system and all of that, right? And uh, not everyone has the, the same amount of, how do you call it? Like white blood, cell, blood cells or whatever that are attacking bacteria i <laughs> when it comes to certain subjects my ling english skills are really making it hard to me to talk about what i want to talk so i won't even bother <laughs> until i get better i guess at english man to to have like more serious and in-depth conversations man but yeah uh what i wanted to say is that thank god it wasn't tuberculosis right and that he managed to cure it with the sulfa drug and i was worried because she was coughing blood right? 
and uh, the scene that really got me and hit hard was the fact that Ruri it's a miracle that Ruri lived so long right because we saw that when she was little that she was coughing and she was sick since she was a little child and usually people with that condition would die right much earlier but thanks to Kohaku's efforts every single day bringing water from hot springs to her sister it prolonged her life and we had that fated meeting between Senku and Kohaku and which led to Rory getting cured man and I really freaking appreciate that also what everyone did right and I like how my boy Chrome felt right he was so happy and yeah Chrome and Rory are <laughs> perfect for each other man i'm not usually the guy who ships characters and all of that man i say that jokingly but chrome and ruri would would really probably be a nice pair right but yeah i really enjoyed that episode it was so wholesome also the scene with us again again right he couldn't go to the village to see ruri getting cured unfortunately and he left alone but senku made it worth right Senku had a surprise for Gen and it was a whole battle of Kola. <laughs> and he enjoyed that a lot, man. You could see through his like expression. That was that was really fantastic. Uh, old guy Kaseki, right? And uh, again, that scene was funny as well when Gen was like, what the fuck do you want, old man? Let me go. And he <laughs> rips his shirt and then he saw how freaking huge he is how jacked he is he was like okay i'll do whatever you want me to do <laughs> that was pretty funny as well so yeah senku experimented on that mouse the mouses are like perfect i guess species for experiments because they have a similar dna to humans like i think more than 95 percent obviously it varies in some uh, types of mouses right but still some of the mouses are even genetically modified and all of that man. it's kind of crazy because we are both like mammals right and we have the same organs like heart brain and all of that I mean, kidneys and whatnot man so that's pretty interesting uh when it comes to ruri and her saying senkus surname right so it it isn't ishida it's ishigami that's really interesting that's obviously senku's surname we saw how senku reacted to hearing that as well and the fact that this is ishigami village is mind-blowing to me because i can't think not even of a theory that would lead to senku somehow being connected to this village like literally nothing comes to my mind i'm really curious to learn why is that exactly man? and how do they know about senku i'm really really curious and i can't wait to start next episode to learn more that was pretty fantastic man i won't talk too much i really enjoyed it i hope that you guys enjoyed the reactions if you did please consider subscribing leave a like comment all that good stuff as always Check out my Patreon page if you want to see full and early reactions. I will be seeing you very soon with another video. Until then, take care and have a nice day. See ya guys.